Here at Scott Legal, we know the complex issues presented by immigration law. We are here to help you navigate the oftentimes difficult road in acquiring or maintaining your immigration status. We have new immigration videos every week. If you are new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button and bell. You can also sign up for one of our webinars or get a free immigration guide by clicking the link below. Many clients ask, does an E2 investment have to come from your home country? Stick around for the answer. An E2 visa is available to individuals from certain countries who want to buy or start a business in the United States. The visa requires applicants to invest in and create jobs in the U.S. What are the E2 requirements and eligibility? There are six key requirements for the E2 visa. 1. You must be a national of a treaty country. 2. You must have invested or be actively in the process of investing in the enterprise. 3. You must be in a position to develop and direct the business with skills. 4. Your investment must be substantial. The required investment amount depends on the type of business you start, but expenditures can be as low as $50,000 for this visa. 5. Your investment in business cannot be marginal. 6. You must intend to return to your home country after expiration of the E-2 visa. You can find a full set of E-2 visa requirements, linked in the description box below. One of the fundamental E-2 visa requirements is that the applicant must be from a treaty country. There are approximately 80 treaty countries including Canada, Australia, France, Pakistan, Chile, Argentina, Japan, the United Kingdom, and more. To see a full list of E-2 treaty countries, take a look at the description below. One question that often comes up is whether the funds invested must come from or originate in the treaty country. The clear answer is no. Provided the funds come from a legitimate source, they can come from any country. For example, if an E-2 applicant from Australia borrowed money from a U.S. citizen to invest, and the U.S. citizen earned the money in the U.S., these investment funds would qualify. There would not be a requirement that the funds came from or originated in Australia. For free E-2 visa resources, please see the description box below. You can gain access to a free E-2 visa guide, weekly webinars, videos, articles, and more. We are here to help. You can contact us by calling 212-223-2964 or by sending us an email. We look forward to hearing from you. You can also schedule a consultation by clicking on the link below, where you can choose a day and time that is most convenient for you.